as we woke up to the uh, explosions this morning that really was a shock to many here. People in Kyiv didn't think even to the last minute that actually Russia is going to go so far as a, a assaulting Kyiv, the capital city. After also, after all, also Vladimir Putin pointed out in this surprised televised, surprising televised address this morning that this is quote a military operation in eastern Ukraine. But it turns out there are various reports that explosions are heard in many parts of the country, shellings and uh, reports of people being injured and killed. Now the problem is we cannot verify this information so I'm not even going to uh, talk about any numbers at this point because as this escalation has entered a new phase there are various accusations between uh, Russian forces and Ukrainian uh, government official military information. What is actually currently happening on the ground? I can only tell you, in fact, what I've been experiencing this morning. And that was a very, very critical situation. People here were packing up, trying to leave uh, by car from the hotel where we are at this point. Also, we are hearing that there are a lot of people lined up at gasoline stations, trying to fill up on gas, trying to leave to neighboring uh, countries Slovakia, Poland towards the west. But we also hear at this point, if you're trying to leave Kyiv, it's in fact almost impossible to go towards the west. So much traffic traffic has built up. Again, there are also people who are just staying put and are trying to uh, inform themselves actually where is the nearest shelter when those sirens are going to uh, go off again, likely as they did this morning, siren warning or in fact telling people this is the time that you should look for your closest shelter.